Hello friends, today we make remote control servo motor using Arduino and block coding. First we open Tinkercad, this is a Tinkercad text code. Now we search Arduino, drag and drop here. Now again search servo motor, this is a servo motor. And now we search remote and sensor. This is a remote and this is a remote sensor, IR sensor. You can also say that TSOP sensor. Click here on the servo motor and rotate it and put the servo motor here and now connect the connection. This is a ground pin, connect to the GND of the Arduino. Second terminal is a power pin, connect to the power of the Arduino. I have connect the power pin. 5 volt and change the color red and signal pin connect to any digital pin I have connect to the 10 pin and also change the color yellow now in the TSOP sensor there is 3 pin output ground and power pin you can also IR sensor output pin connect to the any digital pin I have connected digital pin 3. Now, second terminal is a ground terminal. Connect to the GND. I have connected to the GND. And also make black. And last terminal is a power, power pin. Connect to the power of the Arduino 5 volt. Now, make red. Now, connection is completed. Now, we have to make a port or block code. Click on the code section and delete this code. First we create variable. Click on the create variable. I have put the button. Then click OK. You have to see there is generated three block. We rotate the screen. Take this set block and again go to the input and take the read infrared sensor pin. Our infrared sensor pin connected to the 3 pin. We have to put 3. 3 pin. Now, again, go to the output block and put the print to serial monitor. We have to see the value of when I am clicking on the 1, then what the value is showing. Go to the variable block and put the button and also take one block for the weight. Now, start simulate and see the value of the remote in the serial monitor when I am clicking first then value is 16 when I you have to write in the copy when I am clicking second then value is 17 when I am clicking 3 then value is 18 when I am clicking 4 then value is 20 you have to read all the number all the pin of the remote and write the value in the copy now stop simulate and give the condition Go to the control block and take if block. This is the if block. And go to the and also you now you can delete this wait second wait block. I have already read the value of the remote. Go to the math section and give the condition. In the first block we have to put the variable block because I have to compare the value to the button. When I am clicking first then value is 16. And you have to put equal to and servo motor is connect to the 10 pin go to the output and you have to search the rotate servo pin servo pin 0 you have to put 10 and in the first condition when I am clicking the servo goes to 0 degree now right click and duplicate this and put it here when I am clicking seven another condition then value is 180 degree now start simulate when I am clicking first now you can see when I am clicking first you can see the servo motor is rotating in 0 degree when I am clicking 2 then servo motor is clicking rotating 180 degree you have to put another condition then stop here and right click and duplicate this button and put it here when I am clicking 
4, 3, then value is 17 and we have to make 90 degree. When I am clicking 4 button, then value is 20. Now we have to put 60 degree. Now I have given the 4 condition for the remote and start simulate and see the rotation of the servo motor. First, when I am clicking 1, then servo goes to 0 degree. This is the 0 degree. See that? When I am clicking second, the servo motor is rotated 180 degree. Second, I am clicking 180. And when I am clicking third, then value is, I have to wait for one second. When I am clicking first button, then servo is rotated 0 degree. When I am clicking second, then servo is goes to 90 180 degree. When I am clicking 3, then servo is not rotating because I have not given the condition stop this and you have to change 18. Now start simulate. Now you can see the value. When I clicking open serial motor, when I clicking first, then goes 0 degree. When I click in second, then goes 1, goes 90 degree, you put the 90. When I click 3, then servo goes to 180 degree. Now click 4 button, then go, servo is going to 60 degree. You have to put multiple conditions from the remote. If you want to take this text code, stop here and go to the block and click on the block plus text. You have to see this is a text code, you can copy this code and put it on the Arduino IDE. Also, code link also given in description, you can download the code also. Again, we, you can see the output when I click first, servo is 0 degree, second 180 degree and third when I pressing third, then servo is 180 degree, when I clicking four, then servo is 60 degree. You can change the value from the degree option you have here you write the degree which you want to operate if you have any problem you can comment also thank you all friends